According to the latest report by the Philippine National Disaster Management Agency, 2,357 people have been confirmed dead and 3,853 injured as a result of Typhoon Haiyan. Officials at the UN Office for the Coordination of Humanitarian Affairs say more than 540,000 people have been forced from their homes. Over 160,000 of them have no shelter and are living outside, exposed to the elements. Roads and communications remain severed in typhoon-hit areas. The Philippines is a country of many large and small islands, making the scale of the disaster hard to assess. Some areas are hard to access, even under normal conditions. Since the typhoon, an acute shortage of vehicles and boats is hampering distribution of relief supplies. The Philippine military and other organizations have sent personnel and vehicles to the disaster areas, but they're struggling to cope. Food, uh, water, hygiene kits, um, shelter, also medicine and medical equipment. These are very much a priority at this stage. Uh, also, degree clearance is important so that we have routes cleared um, to get to the outskirts. The United Nations is calling for international aid to help the country with 2.5 million people in urgent need of food.